Daniel Boone is a 1981 animated film. This is directed by Jeff Collins. It's written by Kimma Ringwald. And we have a voice cast including Richard Crenna as Daniel Boone. And I've seen some things about Daniel Boone before, but I don't think I've ever seen anything this comprehensive. So I was really keen to watch it. And I'm pleased to say it's pretty decent. Your opinion might be different to mine if, well, if you're from the States and... I, I don't know, I'm imagining they teach about Daniel Boone at school, but I'm coming at this as somebody who knows or knew very little about Daniel Boone. As I said, I have seen some animations about him, but nothing in too much detail. And I was looking forward to, to doing some learning. That being said, I don't know completely how accurate this is. So if anybody watches this and has any thoughts on the accuracy, whether you can confirm that it is pretty accurate or if there are any specific inaccuracies, please feel free to let me know. But with my discussion, I can't confirm whether it's accurate or not. But I can confirm that it's pretty enjoyable. Daniel Boone is an American folk hero. And I believe he's most well known for exploring what is now Kentucky. The the episode, the animation rather, does address that. And we get to meet... A lot of different characters, but I'll be honest, I have no idea if any of the other characters are historical figures outside of Daniel Boone's family. I don't know if they made up most of the other individuals for the purpose of telling the story or if any of them are actually true figures. So if anybody, again, can provide any information about that, I'd be very interested to find out. I did do a tiny bit of wikipedia after watching this just to get a little bit more information about Daniel Boone, but I didn't do anything too extensive. And to be honest, I didn't necessarily feel like I needed to because this is a really, in my opinion, comprehensive overview of who Daniel Boone is and why he became this American hero. And I find the character to be really interesting. I, I really like his personality, at least the way it's portrayed in this particular animation. And as for the animation quality itself, yeah, it's fine. It's okay. It's not amazing. It's definitely quite rough, but it gets the job done and it, it's watchable. It's not uncomfortable on the eyes or anything. So no real problems there. If you have never heard of Daniel Boone, in my opinion, I'd say it's a good place to start. But again, I'm coming at this as somebody who had very little knowledge about Daniel Boone. If you're already very knowledgeable about Daniel Boone, I don't know how much you'd get out of this, but I would be very keen to find out if you do watch it what you what you got out of it, if you found that it was adding to your education or just something that was entertaining to watch because you're already familiar with the stories in this. So definitely keen on other people's opinions. My opinion probably doesn't count for very much unless, like me, you knew next to nothing about Daniel Boone and you're interested in finding out more. I enjoyed it. As a one-time watch, it's pretty decent. If I ever come across anything else about Daniel Boone, I will definitely check them out. If you can recommend any, please feel free to do so. But for now, I'm happy to say the 1981 Daniel Boone is pretty interesting, generally well done, and if it sounds like it would appeal to you, I'd say it's worth checking out.